when the WordPress not the best solution. Ideally, a content management system fits your content and not the other way around. If your site has uh, posts and pages and media, then your CMS should let you easily manage posts, pages and uh, media. If you have a site running uh, computation on the latest levels of uh, toxic uh, chemicals uh, in the atmosphere, then a CMS based around posts and pages probably would not be the best uh, solution. The first, the first step in determining uh, if WordPress can work for your site is to figure out if it can handle your content. WordPress comes by default uh, with posts and pages, but you can also create custom post types and custom fields uh, to work with a range of other types of content as well. For example, you could create an event uh, custom post type with uh, fields uh, like uh, date, uh, time, location, and cost, etc. And you could even create um, a product custom uh, post type with all the fields uh, that you would need to power an e-commerce uh, site as WooCommerce uh, plugins. If you have a complex site and uh, you are trying uh, to figure out uh, if WordPress is the right solution, you would do well to search uh, to see if there are WordPress related plugins uh, that can add uh, the functionality that you need. For example, if you wanted uh, to build uh, a, job, uh, a job board style site, you would quickly find a number of plugins uh, that uh, turn WordPress uh, into a job uh, board. However, there will be times uh, when WordPress uh, is not the perfect solution. Usually, if WordPress is not the right solution, you could find a more niche built uh, piece uh, of software that could uh, do what you really want. For example, you may want, uh, you may want uh, to have uh, a WordPress site uh, that also does uh, CRM, customer relations uh, and uh, invoices. While WordPress uh, could uh, technically do this uh, with plugins, it's beginning uh, to try to turn WordPress uh, into uh, something that, uh, that is not really uh, meant uh, to be, which um, is a CRM and uh, invoicing uh, tool. In this case, you are probably better off finding uh, software that does that uh, specifically. If you are trying uh, to determine uh, whether WordPress uh, will work for uh, a truly complex site, it would be worth consulting uh, with a WordPress uh, professional developer who could uh, tell you for sure whether uh, it's possible and uh, what the scope and cost of the project uh, would really uh, involve. On the other uh, end uh, of the spectrum, some projects are too small for uh, WordPress. If all you need, for example, is a single page site or even uh, a site with uh, a couple of pages uh, that don't update uh, too often uh, too often WordPress may be overkill and uh, take more time to set up and uh, manage than just uh, building uh, a static uh, site a good rule of the thumb for when to use WordPress uh, on small projects is when you begin to have uh, to place uh, the same content in multiple places throughout uh, the site or when you need uh, the ability uh, to edit uh, the content uh, without uh, someone knowing uh, how to edit uh, code this is when WordPress or CMS becomes a better solution in coding from scratch a lot of alternatives exist uh, to WordPress from small, lightweight uh, CMS uh, to huge enterprise level ones, if you are uh, in the position where you are uh, determining uh, if uh, WordPress uh, is the right fit, I would suggest talking uh, some time to Google alternatives uh, to WordPress for the type of site you are trying uh, to build. 
That's all for when the WordPress not the best solution. See you in next lecture.